when you're looking at this cosine of negative pi over 3, okay, the way I would suggest it, rather than trying to memorize all those rules, again, unless you have, unless it's easy for you to do that, um, what I would do is I just sketch what my angle looks like. So if I took cosine of negative pi over 3, so negative pi over 3 is going to fall right here. Okay, and so my cosine is the x coordinate, right? So I'm going to look at, I'm looking at this value right here. Well, if I were to take here and take the, which of these is equivalent to this, what I'm going to see is the same x, which, what angle is going to have this same uh, x value? Well, if I take the same angle that I did here, my reference angle, pi over 3, and I did it up here, pi over 3, are those going to have the same x? Yeah, so my answer is going to be pi over 3. So I see the cosine of pi over 3 is what's equivalent to the cosine of negative pi over 3. Okay. So if I had something like this, the tangent of negative pi over 6, if I sketch what I have, minus pi over 6 looks right here. Okay, and so if this is my angle pi over 6, and I know my tangent is what? Is my overall tangent positive or negative down here? It's a negative, right? A positive cosine, but a negative sine. Okay, and so what I want to do is I want to find the tangent of negative pi over 6 is equivalent to, and the angle I'm comparing it to is positive pi over 6. So my positive pi over 6 here, well, when I look at that, are these going to have the same tangents or opposite tangents? So here it's a negative, but here it's a positive. So what I'm going to do is I'm simply going to take negative tangent of positive pi over 6, and that's going to be my solution. Again, I can visually see that relationship uh, when I sketch this out. Okay, so my original angle comes here. My sine is along here. But what it's asking me for is I want the, or I'm looking at the negative of this. So it's actually going to be down here, right? So I want the angle whose sine is the same as 150 degrees with a negative, so the opposite of that. So I want an angle that falls down here. Well, I know I'm going to be looking at sines, right? So I'm looking at these two values. So if I look here, sine of 150 versus here, sine of minus 150, which of these is going to have the exact those, this sign right here? the minus 150. So I see that my answer is going to be this option. 